Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you about the measure tool in eDrawings. First of all, when you save your file as an eDrawing, and I'll select it from this drop down menu, let's open the options window. Ensure that OK to measure this eDrawings file is checked. Otherwise, you won't be able to use the measure tool in eDrawings. Here is our eDrawing document. The measure tool icon in the status bar shows us that yes, the measure tool is indeed available. Let's activate it by clicking this icon. First, we select a filter. We've got four options, faces, edges, vertices, and holes. I'm going to use the faces option. I'll select my first face and a second face. Faces 1 and 2 appear in the selected item list. In the results window, we see two items, they're parallel, and their normal distance is 43 millimeters. Now let me show you how to unselect your items. Go back to the selection window here, click on the item and press delete on your keyboard. Or if you select the item again in the graphic area, it'll be unselected too. Let's disable the face and vertex filter, and let's leave the hole filter enabled. I'll select this hole, and I'll select a second hole. So the callout tells us that the distance between the centers of these two holes is 28 millimeters. The same information is displayed in our results window. You might find that your callout in the graphic area is distorted. If that's the case, close your document and then go to Tools on the main menu. I'm just going to actually leave my document open. Go down to Options. Under Performance, unselect Graphics Boost. Currently this option is grayed out because I've got an open document. You might also need the right driver for your video card. Here's a link to approved graphics cards. Let's click on it. Takes us to the SolarWorks website, a list of graphics card drivers. Under Computer Vendor, I'll select any system vendor. Under Graphics Card Vendor, I'll select NVIDIA. Graphics Card Model. Mine's a Quadro. SolidWorks version 2013. Operating System. Windows 7 64 bit and click Show Results. So as you can see, the card that I selected, the FX 3450, does have some limitations. Right from here, you can download the most current driver. And let's close this window. Cancel out of the Options dialog window. To deactivate the Measure tool, you need to click this icon here. And one last thing here, let's go to File, Save As. In this dialog window, we've got a checkbox to enable measure or not. Let's cancel out of the Save As dialog window. And this concludes my video about using the eDrawings measure tool.